plenty of options there at where they stand, but can you imagine Chubb and Garrett for the next 10 years? I mean, I could see them with the spot on trendsetters. That would be so big. What a segue by you. Thanks so much, Will. Oh, yeah. Great report there. We are back here in New York City, and it is time for another edition of Trendsetters. What is that? Well, I'm going to show you gentlemen some clips that have been trending on okay. Twitter and on Instagram. We use a social score algorithm to calculate what is... <laughs> Are those rhinestones on your what is jeans? Tree? Yeah. Oh, I wear like these it. like every other day, and you just now notice them. Uh, they, I colored my hair yesterday, and I thought my work brothers notice either. Okay. You colored your hair? Okay, Nailed it, Kay. 158.3. Kay looks great. Uh, first up, let's get serious here. Okay, all right. LSU running back <laughs> Darius. Guys, pay attention. Kyle's your favorite guy in the draft. Yep. He actually saved a life over the weekend. Uh, after a car accident. So this is how we know because of social media. He said, God keeps blessing me. I just saved a woman's life. He goes on to put this all up on Twitter. Pulled up to a light in South Baton Rouge where a wreck occurred right as I pulled up. It was a big truck and a smaller car. Okay. I get out my car to check the scene and the lady was knocked on the back door. Mm. A window trapped by the airbags. Oh, so man. what does Mr. Geis do but... Save her. Like, Opens the door, lets her out, and he actually posted this video after. Oh, look. What? On Twitter. Twitter. Okay. Hey, guys. She's okay. Wait. Thank you for the prayers. Thank you. I want to get no in, problem, too. But... No problem. <laughs> oh, my so, God. good like, Samaritan and angriest runner. Barry, it's exactly. Like, uh, what do you got? Bruce Willis and Unbreakable. Yes. Right? It happened in college. And he's that strong. He's You're that right strong in college. He the car. When I, I follow him on Twitter. He's and your favorite guy. Like, uh, he's my favorite know. running back in the draft. Really? The number one angry runner by far. Everybody loves Saquon. I'm a huge Darius guy's guy. Love him. So I follow him on Twitter. When he first said I saved a woman's life, I actually thought he was talking about Fortnite. Because he all he tweets about Fortnite <laughs> nonstop. Yeah. This was the real deal. And really, the, the sentimental part of this, if you can call it that, is Darius Geis is extremely family-oriented. Went through a really tough upbringing. Uh, Brain, yeah. everything with his mother and whatnot. So I'm sure that resonated with him here. Lastly, I was a little bit jealous. I've always wanted to have the moment where someone is inside and I can rescue them or something. You see a lot of celebrities have that. I got to call 911 one time for a car accident. I felt like I was a hero. So I was a little bit jealous that I couldn't Why save somebody. Are you I want to save somebody. Nate and I have been in that situation, but we laughed at you when you were choking on pizza instead of calling 911 and helping. Yeah, you guys didn't even get up and help at all. Yeah. We wanted to make sure you were close to death. I need safe. a hero. Bonnie Tyler. <laughs> can I be your hero, baby? <laughs> yes. Next up, all right, always. Enrique. Uh, Josh McCown showed that he... We know this about Josh McCown. He is a friend of the show. He's a superhero in the way of helping uh, Peter Schrager with his fly. We're not going to go into that, but I'll just let you guys ogle this for a while. What do we got? Okay. Well, go ahead, Nate. Listen, <laughs> here's the thing. When I played, there was this rumor oh! about the McCown brothers, yeah. that they were the most athletic group of brothers in the league. And it's not a black or white conversation. It's not like, oh, white dude got hops. Yeah, this, this is more like... <laughs> Two brothers are in the league, and they will take anybody on in a dunk contest, in a one-on-one -on -one game. So I'm not surprised by this. I haven't seen this exact clip. Amazing. So That's the one. This is back from 2014. Really? Somebody dug this up and got, like, wowed by it all over again. So if he's doing this in 2014, oh, Josh! <laughs> That's crazy. Why is, why, why is he not why, in the why, NBA? What is so crazy? He's just doing it all. Hold on, my favorite move's coming up. Which one? It, right, it's the, the freaky deaky he it's does right here. Right here. Right here. Ooh, so, 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 so. Oh! In and out. Chocolate Blanco. <laughs> oh, I absolutely, I absolutely love it. Every Billy Hoyle reference I can make. Nate, Nate, is that thing regulation? That thing ain't regulation. I think it might actually be higher. <laughs> yep, looks good to me. Looks good to me. Josh, come on the show. Come on, let's get a dunk contest love going. This. I cannot believe he's never been in this studio. He's the number one guy who makes no sense he hasn't been on the show. It's he once wild. told Peter to lift up his fly yeah. at Medlife Stadium. <laughs> right. He hasn't been on the show. You know who else uh, hasn't been in studio but we talk about all who? the time? Tom Pelissero, NFL Network's own, one of our okay. favorite reporters. He brings us all sorts of scoops on the regular, but I showed Nate something yesterday during the show that was truly oh amazing, God. and it has made its way into trendsetters. This is Tom Pelissero's daughter bringing us some bars, like, as an adult. Nice man load my lawn, up the hair, up the hair. Nice man my lawn. Up and up and She's fully singing DMX. While cleaning up. It's She's great. an adult. That is me at like 9 o'clock every night. Yeah. It's perfect. <laughs>
How crazy is that? It's, it's amazing. And if you've met the Peliceros, yeah. like that's, that they're the sweetest people ever. It. I love that this is the way it is. My new favorite you child. know where I'm at, Kay? I, I'm sitting here. You know what I'm impressed by? Man, they got a clean kitchen. Look at those they countertops, do. white cabinets. The girl is adorable, but the kitchen is just beautiful. I just Great hope job. those aren't the I think I think I hope those are the only words of that song she knows, because it gets dicey there, you're like right, in the right. next X gonna get it. Right, right, okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's wrap it up with uh, just a belated birthday shout out to Danica Patrick posting this photo celebrating her 36th birthday with her boyfriend. And Aaron Rodgers, ooh, mm. over the weekend. Awesome photo. I did do a deeper dive on this, though. She is from Wisconsin, but she grew up a Bears fan, now dating a Green Bay Packer quarterback. How do you think that's going down? we got to fight fire with fire. Trubisky's got to date a Packers fan. Come on, go get it, Mitch. Come on, we're going to keep up with the Joneses here. Let's babies is going to be incredibly Okay, hey, let's hey, calculate. Already waving the checkered flag. Let's calculate who <laughs> oh, won oh, trendsetters yeah, this week. Great photo of the two of them. I'm loving yes. that power couple. Uh, let's see. Little Pell. Oh, it ain't even close. Takes the cake. Oh, my I goodness. I love this. Right Dunking there. on the Rogers. Little Yachty, little, little Uzi Burt. And Pelser. in a Batman shoot suit, like shirt. That's what a cool amazing. kid. Uh, new rules, by the way. That's Trendsetter. Thanks for playing. New rules that will make this. Take a look right now. This is the catch. Jesse.